Would anyone trust in the convictions of a monkey's mind if there were any convictions in such a mind? And the guy who's behind this is Charles Darwin himself. Okay, he came up with a naturalistic explanation for how we got here, and he realized that if that's true, if it's just some unguided whatever best mutation happened to give rise to this, how can we trust our thinking? I'm like, man, if you want to insist that science must be naturalistic, you've just undercut your whole thinking process, which is what you're trying to do as a scientist, right? I can't trust my ability to think. I certainly can't trust my ability to find truth because it was survival of the fittest that got me here. So, so that's one of the issues that, that comes up with materialism, naturalism as sort of a fundamental philosophy in science today.